Most welcome to your father. teachers and fellow students who have gathered here today to celebrate the spirit of our nation. It is with immense joy and pride that we have gathered here today to celebrate the 75th Republic Day of our great nation. This day holds special significance for every Indian as we pay homage to the ideals that shape our democracy. Your presence adds immense joy to our Republic Day function. I would like to introduce our chief guest for today. Now, I invite our chief guest, our dynamic and visionary principal, Reverend Father Jaz Elanjikal, a beacon of wisdom and might. Father Jaz Elanjikal is a mentor and guide who inspires everyone to be their best. He always fosters and creates an atmosphere of inclusion and respect for everyone. He is a source of inspiration for everyone who reminds us that hard work is the key to transformation. We are privileged to have you with us and we look forward to inspiring words. Before we proceed with the festivities, let us bow our heads in a prayer song followed by the special prayer, seeking blessings, for our nation, its leaders, and the unity and prosperity of our people. Thank you. 
nation and make it true to the ideas of freedom and justice and brotherhood for all who make it great. Guard us from war, from fire and wind, from compromise, fear and confusion. Be close to our political leaders. Give them vision and courage as they ponder decisions affecting peace and the future of the world. Make me more deeply aware of my heritage, realizing not only my rights, but also my duties and responsibilities as a citizen. Make this great land and all its people know clearly your will, that they may fulfill the destiny ordained for us in the salvation of the nations and the restoring of all things in Christ. Amen. Ali, do you know the importance of this event? Yes, Shora. On this day, our constitution was written. Yes, right. But it's not only the event. We have many more things in our Pandora box to share the importance of this event. For, For that, that we, we would like, like to invite Parini from Class 6 Emerald to share the same. Good morning to one and all present here. Republic Day is not just a date on the calendar. It is a celebration of our identity as a sovereign and democratic nation. It marks the day when our constitution came into effect, laying the foundation for a vibrant and diverse democracy. Republic Day is the day when the Republic of India marks and celebrates the date on which the Constitution of India came into effect on 26 January 1950. This replaced the Government of India Act 1935 as the governing document of India, thus turning the nation from a dominion into a republic separate from British Raj. The constitution was adopted by the Indian Constituent Assembly on 26 November 1949 and came into effect on 26 January 1950. 26 January was taken as the date for Republic Day as it was on that day in 1930 when the Declaration of Indian Independence was proclaimed by the Indian National Congress. And now, with great pride and reverence, let us hoist our national flag, followed by the national anthem. School! Chanda! Tilo! Janagana mana adhinayaka jayahe, Bharat bhagya vidhata, Punjab Sindhu Gujarat Maratha, Dravida Uttala Vanga. Himachal Yamuna Ganga, Uchala Jalatika Ranga, Tava Shubhana Mejade, Tava Shubha Ashisha Mage, Gahe Tava Jayagata, Janagana Mangana Dayaka Jayahe, Bharata Bhagya Vipata, Jayahe, Jayahe. Fortitude is the martial of thought, the armor of will and forth of reason. Following the flag hoisting and anthem, our disciplined and dedicated students will present the march first, showcasing the spirit of unity and strength that defines our nation.
वाव दिस वॉज अमेजिंग कदम कदम बढ़ाए जा खुशी के गीत गाए जा ये जिंदगी है कौम की तू कौम पे लुटाए जा हे गुनीत वाई आर यू सिंगिंग दिस यांश डू यू नो दैट द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन टुक दैट टुक दैन मोर मोर टू इयर्स टू फॉर्म इज इट सो यस यस सो प्लीज पुट योर हैंड्स टुगेदर फॉर अ थॉट प्रोकिंग स्टेट हाईलाइटिंग द फीचर्स ऑफ अ कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन इट इज द रिमाइंडर ऑफ अर रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटीज वी वेयर एज सिटीजन ऑफ ग्रेट डेमोक्रेसी I Jawahar Lal Nehru in 1938 on behalf of the Indian National Congress declared that the constitution of free India must be framed without outside interference by a constituent assembly elected on the basis of adult franchise the demand was finally accepted in principle by the British government in what is known as the august offer of 1940 let me introduce the members of the drafting committee i dr b r ambedkar is an indian lawyer economist politician and social reformer who have inspired the dalit buddhist movement i also battle against the social prejudices and against untouchables the chairman of the drafting committee our constitution is prepared in 2 years and 11 months of hard work by the constituent assembly our constitution have many important features which are borrowed from other countries which are as follows from great britain india borrowed the parliamentary form of government from the united states of america india borrowed the concepts of fundamental rights independence of judiciary judicial review impeachment of the president removal of supreme court and high court judges and concept of the vice president The major thing that the Indian Constitution makers borrowed from Russia were the fundamental duties and ideals of justice in the preamble. Australia gave India the concept of concurrent list, freedom of trade, commerce, and joint sitting of two houses of parliament. from france we adopted the concept of republic also the ideal of liberty equality and fraternity were borrowed to be put in the preamble from there we took the concept of emergency from germany also concepts of suspension of fundamental rights during emergency Ireland gave India the idea of directive principles of state policy, the nomination of members to Rajya Sabha, the method of election of the president. From Canada, we adapted federal form of a government with a strong central government, distribution of powers between center and state. We also adopted Supreme Court's advisory function and sent its powers to appoint the governors of states. From Japan, we adopted the procedure established by law. South African Constitution gave India the process of amendment in the Constitution and the way to elect the member of Rajya Sabha. It is a great day for a country. A constitution is a democratic instrument seeking to ensure to the individual the freedom which are so invaluable. We shall be therefore be only implementing in practice under a constitution what we have inherited from our traditions, namely freedom of opinion and expressions. Under the new charter which we are inaugurating today, we hope to live up to the teaching of our master and help in our own humble way for the establishment of the peace in the world. 
I, Dr. Rajendra Prasad, with immense pleasure, dedicate the Constitution to the citizens of India. Jai Hind! Ali, what are you doing? Kyanch, can't you see I'm in full patriotic mood? Yes, yes, but wait. Let me present our talented students. We'll now grace the stage with a mesmerizing dance performance, capturing the unity and diversity. Yeah, I'm 
नन्ना मुन्ना राही हूँ देश का सिपाही हूँ बोलो मेरे संग जय हिंद जय हिंद जय हिंद वाव अर्नब टू गुड वेट गाइस होल्ड ऑन लेट्स टेक अ मोमेंट टू रिमेंबर एंड अप्रिशिएट द सैक्रिफाइसेस मेड बाय आर ब्रेव सोल्जर्स हु सेव गार्ड आर बॉर्डर्स देयर करेज एंड कमिटमेंट टू ड्यूटी make it possible for us to live in peace and harmony let's hear a soul stirring patriotic song which will be presented by our students with love and pride resonating for our country आज के दिन गणतंत्र बना था संविधान हमारा स्वतंत्र बना था प्रजातंत्र ये स्वतंत्र हमारा ही गणतंत्र बना था आज के दिन गणतंत्र बना था देखो आज फिर वही दिन है आया जो आते ही हमारे दिलों में है छाया सिर्फ यही नहीं एक राष्ट्रीय त्यौहार हर भारतीय को है इस त्यौहार से प्यार हर भारतीय को रहता इस त्यौहार का इंतजार गणतंत्र से पहले 
भारत का तानाशाही के अंधकार में राष्ट्रीय एकता भाईचारे क्या सूर्य प्रकट हुआ था लिखित संविधान से संविधान हमारा कलमबद्ध हुआ था आज फिर वही दिन है आया जो हमारे दिलों में है छाया तो आओ इस देश को करते हुए नमन खत्म करें इंतजार और मनाए गणतंत्र दिवस जो है हमारा राष्ट्रीय त्यौहार धन्यवाद जय हिंद Now I invite our respected principal Reverend Father Jas Elangical to address the gathering sharing thoughts on significance of Republic Day. Respected coordinators, teachers and you my beloved children. Good morning to all of you. Today we are having anticipated celebration of republic day tomorrow whole world particularly whole nation will watch the magnetic show that is going to happen and which will boost the spirit of patriotism in each one of us today i would like to urge all of you that you know we should have the love for our country it's not simply saying that i love my country but you should show your love in action love in action when you take care of the public property when you take care of every citizen that is suffering when you care for the people who are jobless when we care for the people who are in pain when we care for the people who are you know orphans every citizen has the right to live in this country and constitution gives that right so therefore let us be a good citizens good citizens in our words action in everything that we do So once again I wish you all happy republic day in advance and I would like to thank our band master Tejram sir and his team today for the first time they displayed the ba the band here It is only a starting and they are going to do many miracles and merry magics before us as the day progresses so without hard work nothing comes into actualization therefore put our heart and soul in everything that we do have a nice day god bless you happy republic day thank you today we are also going to release some magazine i invite the magazine committee to come and you know enlighten theme of the magazine and introduce the members who are there in bringing up this magazine good morning everyone we are really glad to introduce the second edition to you all so i would hand over the mic to hamad who is the head of editorial team good morning everyone we are glad to present the second edition of the zine to you all Zine is the compact and digital form of a magazine which is made by the students for the students. This edition is special to us as it was not the easiest or the smoothest because we had to face many exams in between. First of all, I would like to thank the principal for allowing us the extra time which we needed to complete the zine. Also, I would like to thank the teachers for being so patient with us and supporting us. Most importantly, I would like to thank the members of my team who have outdone themselves in trying to make this edition better than the former i believe that they have done a great job in doing so and i hope that the students after us will do an even better job that's it from my side i would like to call forward sudhir to brief us about the second edition and share his thoughts good morning everyone from those sleepless nights to having the magazine being printed it has been a wonderful journey filled with quarrels and debates It is dedicated to senior high, particularly 12, featuring their first ever yearbook. 
The zine is a wonderful effort to make students more engaged in school affairs and events. It marks the start of a more student-centric environment in our school, giving vital opportunities. I would like to thank Reverend Father Jas Langical for providing us such opportunities. Zine is a culmination of hard work of many people, including our design head, Dishti Ratawal, assistant designing head, Maas Ilahi, student coordinator, Hamad Khan, head boy, Yash Mudgal, and creative head, Sudhir Bhopli. I would also like to thank our teacher coordinator, Ms. Rashmi, for her valuable scoldings. I would also like to thank the teachers responsible for this edition, Ms. Megha, Ms. Rashmi, Ms. Deepthi, and Ms. Alisha. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. As we unveil our school's second magazine edition, my heartfelt thanks to dedicated team. I want to express my deep appreciation to Mazilani, assistant head who played a pivotal role in the design and printing of the magazine. Special applause to Ashmita for her unwavering commitment and to Yash, Parmeet, Hanya, Arnav and Sima for their invaluable contributions. As Ashmita takes the lead for next academic year, I urge all students to consider joining the magazine committee to infuse your unique talents. Thank you. A very good morning everyone. It has been a pleasure working with these amazing and creative people under the designing committee. We have tried our best to make this edition of Zine as best as possible by listening and implementing the reviews which we got after the first edition. But we are not quite yet perfect and I hope the students who will be taking up this responsibility will continue to work hard. Lastly, I would like to thank our principal, Reverend Father Jasil Anzigal, for being so positive and supportive and giving us all the space and freedom to pursue our zine. Thank you. competition was organized in this school on 25th of August 2023. 256 students from class 1 to 9 participated. Following students secured first position in different group categories. Ahan Topo of class 1 secured first position in group 1 category. Fatima of class 2 secured first position in group 2 category. Ananya single of class 3 secured first position in group 3 category. of class 7th Ruby secured first position in group 4 category. Samarth Sachdev of class 8th Diamond secured first position in group 5 category. Certificate of Appreciation is also presented to Ms. Deepthi for her active involvement and cooperation in India Spelling Bee. May the lessons we learn from our history guide us towards a future that is thus inclusive and prosperous. For this, I would like to invite Yashi and Sanjali for a vote of thanks. Being Republic is the greatest achievement that mankind has ever earned. Good morning, respected Principal, Reverend Father Jas Langical, teachers and my fellow Michaelites. 
I am honored to be here to deliver this vote of thanks on the behalf of the entire Republic Day program team. First, I would like to thank our principal for giving us an opportunity to showcase our talents and to come together and celebrate the 75th Republic Day of India. I would also like to thank our teachers and students for their hard work and dedication. They are the ones who have taught us about the values that a Republic is founded on. I would extend my greetings to the auxiliary staff for their hard work and support. Finally, we would like to thank our fellow Michaelites for being here today. It is your presence that made this event so special. A country is strengthened by its citizens and citizens are strengthened by its constitution. Thank you and Jai Hind. As we are near to the end of our celebration, our students will come together for a grand finale dance symbolizing the collective strength and resilience that defines our nation. Let the spirit of patriotism and unity fill our hearts today and every day. अपना है दिल ये आज का दुनिया से जाके बोल दो बोल दो ऐसे जागो रे साथियों दुनिया की आंखें खोल दो खोल दो लहरा दो
सबसे आगे होंगे सुनो गौर से दुनिया वालों पूरी नजर ना हम पे डालो चाहे जितना जोर लगा लो सबसे आगे होंगे हिंदुस्तान हमने कहा है तुम भी कहो So we request everyone to kindly stand in attention position, place your right hand on your heart and get ready for the school anthem. Amen. Yeah. 